G'day and welcome back to Stitch Up and another episode of Factorio. This is our Lake World series and this episode I'm really excited. So um, last episode was all about making the robots and making the robot network and I'm actually outside the base here just sitting here in this sort of area in the middle because this is where we're going to be working today and I want to show you my logistics and robotics network. So yeah if we have a look here I've been placing down some of the robo ports uh, you can see the coverage that comes along. Um, I've actually gone into uh, the earlier part of the bus and just put in some extra little bits and pieces power poles and uh, various sort of inserters and uh, undergroundies all those sort of things all the different types of inserters where are they they're all um, where are they all I put those guys in a lovely little spot uh, where is it here all the different colored inserters green purple blue red uh, and even got the yellow ones sort of stockpiling and then all into the red uh, the new red chests and so that is lovely and also I've set it up with a personal logistics and auto trash network so I uh, can make sure my inventory always has these amount of everything so I think we're ready to rock and roll and uh, get into the episode this episode we're going to be um, building some new walls and joining to the the satellite base with the regular base as discussed at the end of last episode so jump in enjoy the stitch up intro and i'll see you in just a sec Okay, so what I'm going to do is, you can see these bugs are still coming to attack us. Um, and so if we have a look here, I think while I work, because I just want to look at where my, I want my new northern northern defense, and I think I want to put it right across here. Just having a look to see how far these bugs are. Here they come. Here come some of them now. Uh, actually, we might just, there's only four of them, so let's just see if we can get them ourselves. There's only one that should spit at us. And the laser got the other one anyway. So that, yeah, you can see we still get into a little bit of trouble. But um, that is fine. I'll grab a bit of fish there. What I might just do is, um, yeah, I'll keep these trees here and I'll keep the bugs there. And we'll put the, I think we'll put him across just here. That's enough space. We aren't going to be doing much in this area um, at the moment. And we'll go out and take care of these guys in a little bit. But I think what I might do is just pop down some manual protection. So if I grab some gun turrets, uh, and I'm just going to put them here. And just say, just while I'm building... Um, can you four turrets, please, uh, just get these guys. And that will save me a little bit. And I'll just see if I could just pick up a few more there. I can. Uh, why have I got these guys here as well? If I go here and trash the yellow bullets, take half of them, put them in there. And they'll be lovely. Okay, so we're trashing that. And we're keeping it all a bit nicer now as well. Everything should be um, should be uh, checked here. Now, 200 of these guys should be two stacks. But I've actually got an extra few because I was testing to see whether or not I could build. And whether or not my bl blueprints would work. I think I'm going to put him in about here. So what I would like to do is just just make an area um, first of all is make a little template and then we can um, fix it up and I'm going to put a mix of conventional uh, bullets as well as uh, the other ones and we're going to use this box just here so conven conventional um, turrets and the laser turrets so let's start off uh, oh I don't have um, these on my hotbar anymore but let's put them here okay cool so what we're going to want is we know we're going to want that uh, let's do it a little bit longer like this. Yeah, let's do that. Yep. And then we want to we want to do the same as we have been doing previously. So we're going to get ourselves uh, one, two. I'm going to do three turrets worth in the new in the new one. And then we can remove these guys. And then what we'll do is we will um, grab uh, one of the other laser turrets. And I think I'll put these guys about sort of here. And then uh, we can do uh, see another laser turret there. So if I do that, uh, let me just grab one of the these. So if I do say this here and power pole here, let's just see the spacing of the power poles. Just see where we're going to need it. Right, I'm just trying to work out a nice little template for my new type of walls. And it doesn't really matter exactly what we're doing here. Uh, I will take this guy uh, heading in this direction. Um, and that would be great. These guys will come into here. So that would be pretty good. Um, so those guys would connect up nicely, wouldn't they? Okay, maybe that's what we need as our, as our kind of 
area. Um, do we want to also go... Hmm. Maybe what we'll do, let's see, I'm just seeing here, maybe if we can go is to... Having a little gap there, aren't we? Yeah, we are. Okay, let's do that. What about if we did that? Um, yep. And... So you can be uh, sort of here, and then these guys can be... There, we'll try that. Okay, let's see if let's see if this will be a nice little repeatable one. And I know that's not the best spacing of the power poles, but we'll see if that kind of works. Um, right, so let's see. We want it from there to there. Okay, so I just want to see if that's a nice repeatable structure. Uh, actually, we might just need one extra one of these. Okay, um, and let's go uh, Control C. What we want to do is see if we can place this here so if i put this guy uh, let me see actually you know what we'll do we'll go uh control x and i'll do that and it'll place those for deconstruction uh now we will have to bring some oh there's a there's a warring party there should we watch them so they're coming in the other side so we'll have to be very careful here uh, i've actually got it set up as well so these biters will go here but some some bots will come over there and they'll start fixing that as well uh so let's see if this is going to be a nice little repeatable area uh, the other thing i'll need to do is is get uh some actual um let's get some actual ones of these so if i grab this yeah i'm gonna need the robo ports and they're gonna have to connect up to the network as well uh so let me do these guys are connected so what i'll do is i'll run across and let me see if i go yeah that's kind of that's kind of nice i might just see if i can do this like this That's good. And I'm going to look at the horizontal bar here and see if we can get these guys across. I like it. I'd like the network to sort of join up. So that's not too bad. Yeah, we'll put that one there. And of course, we'll have to power these guys shortly. But just looking at the area of work, and it is within the range there. So that's pretty good. Uh, look at a nice horizontal check here. These don't have to be exact, but I have been a bit finicky with them. Uh, and you've got your area of work there. Um, and this is going to be an interesting little area here because he's not going to be... See, that's not bad if he just goes there. Okay, let me see if I can just get through that. Yep, there we go. Um, and we will make this guy... There. Okay, and a couple of quick uh, bits of... Bit of this. Okay, and of course, just gonna make these guys connect up just crudely, just so we've got, got these guys being able to work. Um, and every odd above just being able to work. See the deconstruction, so my robot should be coming across now, but once we get across to this network, because we've got to connect, we've essentially got two networks together there. Oh, here we go. Oh, oh, oh. Man, that, that, they, they really hit me, don't they? Oh man, okay. Right, well that's going to be a real pain. I'm just going to have to come and get that. Let me come back and get my, myself together here. Oh god. Oh god, okay, right, that's a long way back. Look at all the robots working. Started clearing out some trees here as well. Uh, these things happen. Jeez, a couple of bites and you get killed. Um... Uh, I think I've got some defender bots as well. Yeah, I've said my uh, thing here that I should get 100 defender bots. However, these guys are not being made automatically anywhere. I was just manually crafting them. So one thing I will have to do is go ahead and grab some defender bots uh, crafted up. Um, right, here we go. We're up here, aren't we? Yeah, so these guys are all working now, which is good. Uh, I'll pick up my body. I'm hoping I can get everything here. Yep. And am I back to where I was? I am back to where I was. That's good. Watching out for our friends again. Okay, let's go straight across. So all he's doing is powering up. 
That wasn't a smart way to power it either. It could have just gone straight down from here. But this will all be temporary. So these guys are all uh, put together, and that is good. Um, do you need to watch these raiding parties, though, don't we? Okay, we got the deconstruction there. Uh, did I just... I did, actually. Oh, I can't believe I did that. I literally can't believe I just did that, actually. Okay, let's do it again, then. So let's do it again. Okay. And, oh, God. Yeah, there's the turret. Okay, good. Okay, so, um, we'll do this. Let's just make it a little bit smaller. Actually, let's make it a little bit smaller this time. Uh, grab it a conventional one of these. And we went one, two, three. Get rid of these two. That'll be the distance. And there we're going to want... Um, this and now we will need a laser turret um, actually no let's let's make it a bit sort of a little bit sort of better here okay yeah and then I think I'll just go and put power poles in later I'm not going to include the power poles in the blueprint I don't think um, let me see here so we'll go like this and you guys are good. Yeah, so I think that's it, how it's going to be. I just need to grab uh, these. So there and there. Allow me to put a power pole in the middle a bit later, hopefully. Uh, but we'll see about it. In fact, no, let's put these guys there. Okay, so that should be the repeatable one. I probably have done it in a bad spot again because this is where I wanted it to go. Um, yeah, I think I have actually. So if I do it again here and go uh, <laughs> Control X, cut it. Uh, actually, yeah, that, they're going to start building that very shortly, so that'll be good. So let's make this here, here, here. Is that? Is that? kind of how it's working yeah the the um, constructor bots were working nice and quick which is good um, and then we'll just put in okay so I just want to go uh, control C again and copy this and let's get this guy in here okay all right I'm hoping that is going to be right not build on water. There we go. That's good. The purple ones do go over the top, which is great. Uh, I'm just going to manually put up uh, some of the other walls, which will be good. Yep. And let me just do this with the walls. Actually, the, the bot should be building most of these, but I'm just going to put a second line of wall over the top. Okay, these guys are going to be good. Now we need to route up uh, this here. So let's get uh, this going like this. All right. And I want this to now go uh, this way. They'll take from the corner, which is nice. Yep. And that should be good. So these guys should start to make that up, which would be excellent. Uh, can I grab myself? I've got six more of these because I just did that. So I should be able to at least seal it. And we'll keep these guys up front just protecting while we build it. So that'll be good. Okay, so that's all going to start getting going. Um, I can power it up as well as, as discussed. Um, and again, this is temporary and crude. And I do want to start uh, automating my uh, production of... That's what we do. Oh, yeah. Let's see how that goes. So if we go here... I want to start automating my production of... Seeing if this works. Will this work? I think so. Let's see. don't know if that... Okay, just don't know if we've got all the lasers there, but I think we do cover them all. So let's see how it goes. Um, and of course, we may have no bullets left in here. Let's see about this. No, we're just one, we're one little tile off, so that's fine. So we put this guy here. 
Okay, and we want a single line of those guys as well, to be excellent. Right, this is lovely. Um, actually, what we might do is, I think what we might do just to fix this up, oh no, deconstructors can use, can do that, can't they? It's funny, I need to work out how to move a lot of the stuff around, because the deconstructors will bring it to um, some of these boxes. Let me put some of them here, so they're nice and close. Yep. And they, they're, they're saying they're outside of the network. Ah, yes, of course they're outside the network because the network is there. Okay, so we'll just take these guys out. Oh, is that is that them attacking? It is them attacking there. I will na manually need to go there. They're attacking this. Okay, so, um, yes, I, uh, I don't know what happened. The game just completely froze there. Okay, let's see how this is going, because we're obviously having problems with the bullets coming in. They haven't started building this yet. I'll have to maybe manually add in bullets into a few of these guys. Yeah, that could be good. Let's just add a few into there. I'm assuming that we can also put in uh, some of our um, repair packs and pop those guys into this robot port. And they'll actually work... Yep, let me just grab all of those guys and they'll start to repair some of that as well. So some of the bots will head out and repair it. In fact, this bot here, let's watch him. There's two of them. They should be coming out and hopefully these guys will start to look at that. There they go, repairing that one as well. We just need the um need to start seeing a little bit more of the the bullets. Uh, and in fact, I now can pick these guys up. Uh, let's mark them as deconstruction. And see, oh, sorry, no, mark them as uh, so deconstruction is like this. Yeah, okay, there we go. So they should be ready for deconstruction, which is good. And hopefully that's in... Oh, it's outside of the green zone. So no, we'll have to just manually pick those up. Uh, because we don't have a RoboPort covering that. Jeez, we're lucky to have gotten this together, I think. Uh, right, okay, so that is a lot of those guys, isn't it? And hopefully the electric turrets are all good. Yep, they seem to be all fine. But we have problems here. It's just the, it really is just the supply of the, um, of this, isn't it? The supply of the, oop. Okay, it's the supply of our lovely bullets. Uh, but there you go. That's a nice, nice uh, defense there. Now, I've asked them to keep stocking me up with the walls. So they should be getting me more walls. Uh, what have we got here? Wall situation is showing as 100. Um, ooh. Personal logistics disabled. I don't know why. Uh, maybe because I died. Yeah, maybe. Um, either way, we've got the wall situation. So I should be getting walls delivered to me shortly. Uh, and then what we can do is we can go ahead and put a uh, third and fourth amounts there, which would be really good. Uh, I'm actually going to ask for... Can I get these? No. no. I don't need those trees deconstructed do I know I need to wait for more walls as well that'd be good let me just use the walls here so I can see so I got four so at least I can see when they come in uh, right what I would like to do is let's grab those these guys and just put them um, here right there's the four logistics uh, ones, uh, boxes. And I want to now mark uh, for deconstruction. I want to mark uh, this. Just carefully mark some stuff. These will be deconstructed. Now, once they get deconstructed, I'm hoping they go into here. Um, but it sounds like they may not. Because I want those walls to be used elsewhere, don't I? But yeah, once we get all this deconstructed, and we can get some of this stuff done as well. Uh, now, we're open to the south, aren't we? We are. Okay, so let's get rid of those. Okay, so there's a bit for them to do there. Okay, and how many walls have I got now? Yeah, I've got some walls as well, which is good. Okay, I'll just finish one project at a time then. Let's grab some of this. But you can see now everything's moving a lot quicker for me because I can make, I can start to make things quicker and these guys will, will do it for me. Um, yeah. Uh, in fact, we can do, uh, can't we? We can, we can go like uh, this. I can do that. 
do this and this. I don't know why I did deconstruction plan. Ah, did I do control X there? Was that it? Why are you taking away and building? Um, okay, let me do this. Yeah, there we go. Okay, there we go. So that should be good. I don't know why these guys are... I don't know what is happening here. If I just remove those... Did I have some deconstruction planner going? So hopefully these walls are ghosts and they'll be ready to go. Yeah, obviously I need to work out how to control everything a little bit better. Okay, this is good. Um, now, if I go to... No, not that. Need to work out how to pick up some of this. Um, if I go deconstruction planner, Alt D. Yep, and I can start to get some of this up as well, which would be good. Okay, let me see if I can grab these guys, just them. Okay, that's that. And this. Uh, what else, what else, what else? We want this. Yep. And we can pick up this as well, actually. Yeah. Everything there. And let's just grab everything there as well. Okay, good. Now, uh, if we have a quick look here, we are defended across the top, but we're open here still. Uh, oh, it's down to that wall, isn't it? Because that's just down to there. Now, they can get through here. It's right up to the water. But what I need to do is work out where we're going to defend up to. Because I think at the moment we're just defended here. Um, hmm, what's happening up there? Not a whole lot. Okay, cool. All right, so defended up the top. Uh, I can remove all this now, but what I need to do is just make sure we are defended here. Okay, I can go down and manually do that, can't I? Well, we can probably use some of the bots. Although, no, I don't have... Um, yeah, because once I do this, I can remove all this and really open up the base a bit, uh, which would be quite good. Okay, let's just make sure that the walls go all the way across and then we should be good. So uh, I want to manually do this um, because I don't need to, I need to extend the bots and I'll, what I'll do in between episodes is I'll extend the bot range to cover the entire base, including the new satellite inclusion. Uh, I love this because look, it stocks up my walls here, which is great. Just stocks everything up beautifully. Okay, just a nice defended kind of barbican of a wall here. Don't really have a lot of things happening here. Uh, what I will just do is just pop in a couple of these laser turrets manually. Let's just put a few in here, get them going, um, because then they can defend this, this corner quite nicely. We can use our patterns. That's a lot of lasers there, really lining them up, but uh, that's fine. Okay, and just, of course, a power. Great. Okay, these guys are good. All right. So, yes, I'll be able to... Look, the bots, there the, There go the bots doing all that, which is excellent. Uh, now, we can actually get rid of... Uh, if I go deconstruction planner here, I can get rid of uh, all of these trees. Yep. And then I will get rid of all of these trees as well. We're in the work... Uh, we're not in the work zone there, so I'll have to extend... So these guys are ready to go. I will have to extend the work zone down as well, because you can see here we're in a green zone. There we go. All right, let's see about this. All the little bots are working, and it is absolutely lovely. Um, these guys here, are you not in the zone? Is it power? Oh, yeah, you, you've got issues there. You're not powered because of... Ah, you were relying on this. That's why. Okay, why are they all cramming around me? I really need to work out how the bots 
let's work a bit better. Okay, so you're all working. You should be within the zone now. Maybe it's a charge. Maybe it's just going back after charge, because this one's charging. There he goes, and then this stops flashing. So now they can go back to here. Uh, and let's see, once they start dropping their stuff back. So what are they doing? Dropping bullets back in? Okay. Hmm, interesting. Alright, so I think we're going pretty well. I'm happy with how everything's kind of going. Um, yeah, I think this is good. What else? Next episode, um, yeah, it's been, it, look, it's been uh, one of those episodes where I'm trying to work out how everything uh, works. I need to um, find out where to get the materials after they get deconstructed. Uh, but I'll start to use some of the bots to deconstruct and put into some of the chests and things. But I, I do need to work out exactly how to get a lot of this stuff around. Because really, we've got a few different parts of the base. We've got up here for uh, requesting a lot of the uh, parts. If I want to start working in the extremities of even the base, I need to have much more coverage here of the port. So I will get the robo ports in. Um, the logistics network, the orange zone, where the logistics can be not the work network, the green but the actual orange um, it needs to really be uh, thickened out a little bit there so I'll get heaps and heaps of ports in put lots and lots of ones across here it'll cover all of this all of this um, we'll have this entire section sealed up uh, we'll cover up here as well and I'll go down and cover down there as well so next episode you can expect all of that done then if we look to future episodes we know the next thing in our um, uh, in our future is going to be um, uh, it's going to be uranium and nuclear power so we'll be doing some of that we're going to have to go to war to clear out some of these bases and um, thicken our defenses a little bit but yeah we probably um, yeah and then we need to look at what's happening with uh, science and of course extending this here because we did talk about possibly putting in uh, now that we've got this part of the, this we've talked about possibly um, getting rid of these guys and maybe even getting rid of four of these bases and then extending this all the way down maybe landfilling this and we can have a giant solar solar uh, plant over here uh, and we talked about yeah so uranium is definitely going to happen um, god there's so much to do so it's uranium yellow science is uh, happening and then it's of course the natural progression is it gonna be, we're going to be doing yellow science uh, and we're going to be progressing yellow science all the way to the point where we will have um, got our last bits of uh, science here so so if we have a look here, uh, these are the final ones um, with the yellow science. So we might as well just start up one of those. Yeah, let's get a few of these guys going as well. And uh, we've got some yellow science all backed up. But um, yeah, it's going to be good. Okay, don't forget to leave some comments, like, subscribe to Stitch Up, and I'll see you in the very next episode of uh, Factorio. This is our Lake World series. Cheers.